Hello, everybody, and welcome back to a Pokemon Ranger. In the last one, uh, we rescued Celebi, as the mission name would suggest. And uh, it was great. We had a good time. Murph had a good time. Learning experience. Really great for everybody. And in this one, um, we have a new mission. So I, I, you know, I don't know all the details. I, you know, my limited Googling did not really explain this to me. And I was not paying attention for most of it. But, um, so this new mission, recover the precious egg. You have to go into the special mission screen and you have to press all these buttons and then you can enter a code. And then I entered a code and then it unlocked this mission. Apparently it was like an event or something. I don't know. I don't really know. But you use it to get an egg for one of the games, like Diamond and Pearl, I think. I don't know. I could just be straight up lying right now. But uh, yeah, I did all of that. And so now I have this mission, and I think you can only play it once, like, per cartridge. Maybe once per cartridge? Or you can only, like, get one egg per cartridge? I really don't know. But we have this mission, and I've never played it before, actually, so that's really fun. Professor Hastings obtained a Manaphy egg, but it was stolen by the Gorok Squad before they could do any harm with the precious egg. Recover it from the criminals. Start the mission. Yeah. Uh-huh. Oh, hi, Cameron. Huh? What could that be? It looks freaky to me. What's this thing that's washed up here? It doesn't look like anything I've seen before. I'm sh it sure is pretty, though. That transparent blue. It's like looking at a miniature ocean. I feel calmer just looking at it. Hey, I know. This pretty thing would make a great gift for that hectic Professor Hastings. <laughs> oh, Cameron. Gazing at this every day might do something to help curb his natural impatience. Okay. Well, we'll see. Professor, howdy. Everybody loves saying howdy lately, which I love. Hello, Cameron. Why the big smile? Are you having a good day? Ah, if it isn't Cameron. What's, oh, God, the voices. Ah, if it isn't Cameron, I trust everyone is doing well at your ranger base. How are things in Summerland? Back to normal? Oh, yes, yes, Gordo. The Korok Squad buzz has disappeared, so they've disbanded. Slow down, Professor. Give me a chance to answer your questions. I'm here for a reason today. Professor, I've brought you the perfect gift to help your impatient nature. G gift, you say? Cameron's gifts are famous for being bizarre and unsuitable. Uh, never mind that. I, I just said that I wish you wouldn't go out of your way. What's wrong, Professor? It's not like you to turn down a gift. Here you are. Now, what might this be? I've never seen anything like this. Oh, no, perhaps not. I may have seen this somewhere recently, but I'm not altogether certain. If only they knew. I found it on the beach in Summerland. Don't you feel calmer and more relaxed just looking at it? I think it will be good to display it where you can look at it when you get irritated with work. Oh, Karen, you have the best intentions. Okay, Professor, I'm heading back out to Summerland. Cameron doesn't get it, does he? If anything, this enigmatic is put before our eyes, we're more likely to get excited than becalmed. We're scientists after all. Blah, blah, blah. We're scientists after all. Doesn't it excite you, Professor? I, I've had enough of the Professor's excitement, thank you very much. My head is already buzzing with excitement. Hmm, I'm getting an uncontrollable urge to determine exactly what this is. I have a feeling that I've seen this somewhere else before. That's it. I remembered. This is a Pokemon egg. It's very similar to those in the reference papers on Pokemon I ordered from the Sinnoh region. This thing? This thing is a Pokemon egg? None have been confirmed in the Fiori region before. You got no eggs here? Then how you got Pokemon? That has to be it. There's no question about it. It must have been carried here on the sea's currents from some distant land. This is quite the rare discovery, especially for Cameron, giving his love for finding useless junk. By the way, I've heard there are Pokemon that, upon hatching, mistake the first thing they see as their mom. Imprinting. Okay, Twilight. Can you imagine when this Pokemon hatches, Professor? It would be funny if the Pokemon mistook you to be its mother. Hilarious. No, no, there's nothing funny about that. Anyway, I'll be off to Ringtown. I want to show this to Spencer, Murph, and the others. Why Murph? Is Why is Murph so high up on your list? He's like, ugh, gotta show this to Murph. Murph is gonna love this. One of them may surprise us and know what sort of Pokemon is in this egg. Why, it might even be Malvira. That's just a hunch, of course. 
There's no point in putting off a good thing. I'll be off. Mind the lab while I'm gone. Oh, why is he in such a rush to see me? He's like obsessed with me. Back off, Professor. Oh my god, Nav. Why is this, pro what, Professor? You know there's hooligans about. Why'd you not go with anybody? The Go Rock Squad, didn't you break up? Are you calling Gordor Commander again? Um, Gordor, he's in our past. What he does now, or where he may be, is of no concern to me. My only interest is to revive the Gorak squad to his former glory. But with the way we are now, people will rightly consider what I say to be more no more than a mere pipe dream. However, Prof Hastings, if I were to have that Pokemon egg you hold, all that could change. How do you know of this egg? And why would the egg lead to the resurrection of the Gorok Squad? I fail to see the connection. How did I learn of the egg? Think of it this way. Everything you do and say is no secret to me. Perhaps you should be suspicious of your lovely assistant, who is always close by. You're saying my assistant is a spy? Now that you say it, it is rather unnatural how she puts up with my impatience without a word of complaint. No, not the assistant. Anyway, Professor Hastings, I'll ask you nicely. Please hand over your egg without any fuss. If at all possible, I would like to avoid getting into rough stuff with a senior citizen. Oh my god. <laughs> Take it from me, if you can. He jets off. <laughs> if you think of me as an old man, you're in for a rude awakening. I'm different from the frail being that had the super styler taken away. Through a daily training program, I've regained the sharp physique of my youth. <gasps> He takes off his lab coat and he's ripped. <laughs> you have to baked, you have baked lot. I can twist, crumple, and toss aside easily. Sigh. Very well shown the error of his ways. I'll show you the fruits of my training. Twist, crumple, and toss. Twist, crumple, and toss. It sounds like a Harry Potter spell. Ow, 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 ow. Ah, stop. Don't twist. Your training method was apparently ineffective. Thank you for the Pokemon egg. It will eventually lead me to the sea crown. Farewell, Prof Hastings. Oh my god. <laughs> Those rotten thugs. He's getting more of like British as I go. That's really fun. Those rotten thugs getting violent with an old man. But what did he mean by the sea crown? No time to waste. Spencer and Malvira must be informed. <laughs> There's terrible, te there's terrible trouble afoot. Oh my god, that's quite the entrance. Everyone, calm down and listen. You, you seem to be the only one who is not calm. Just saying. The blue Cameron's egg is a Pokemon. The Go Rock Squad took the present, and my training was ineffective. <laughs> calm down, me. I was robbed of a precious Pokemon egg by the Go Rock Squad. The egg was colored a transparent blue, like the color of the sea. I don't know why they took it, but the Go Rock Squad is trying to regroup. They said something or another about a sea crown. A transparent blue egg, the sea crown. Malvira, your expression tells me that you seem to know something about them. Do you maybe know what kind of egg it was, Malvira? Yeah, it was freaking Manaphy. What? A Manaphy egg? The Manaphy? The one that is mentioned in the ancient legend about the sea crown? Yeah, the very same. I, I remember now too. The legend told of the sea temple, which is said to drift eternally in the seas. And somewhere in the sea temple, the sea crown is said to be hidden away. Manaphy is supposed to be the only being capable of somehow getting to the sea temple, which is said to be invisible. Oh my god, there's a lot of lore. The Govrock Squad's true intention must be to use Manaphy to locate the Sea Temple and obtain the Sea Crown. Oh my god. For the legend says, the bearer of the Sea Crown shall become the world's king. The Govrock Squad is de de desperate to regain his former glory. If we are to do anything, now is the only time. Malvira, you're in charge of this mission, as always. Your job is to safely recover the Manaphy egg that was stolen by the Govrock Squad. <laughs> no problem. <laughs> Easy shit. Lunik, you're my insurance policy. I want you to support Malvira. Murph, tell us a joke. Roger. Malvira, I've got your back. Let's hustle to the Lyra Forest. Oh, sorry, Slowpoke. Didn't mean to hit you there. 
Listen, listen, Elvira. I just got a mission from Professor Hastings, too. Do you want to know what sort of mission I got? I'll tell you. Okay, I did not ask. It's a little long, but the mission's called Go to Professor Hastings' lab and search for Pokemon reference documents. I think it's going to be pretty dangerous, but I'm up for it. Let's look good on our missions. Oh, Murph, you're an angel. Bye, Slowpoke. Okay. Let's go find this egg. Recover the precious egg. <sighs> go Rock Squatch, still be in the Lyra Forest. All right, I guess we'll find it. Oh, brings me back the memories of times of old. Ugh. Freaking gravelers all up in my way. Gotta get the freaking Politoed! And a mudkip. Wild Pokemon. Come here, Politoed. Stop spinning around. Like, do you mind? Ugh, Politoed, stop it. Gotcha. Nice try, you fought. Okay. Capture complete. A Pikachu! Come here. Politoed, use the thing and do the thing. Yes, awaken the Graveler. Darn it, how'd you spot me? Um, you're good to be able to see through my Graveler's camouflage. But let's see you capture them. That's another story. A <laughs> few Graveler. Pfft, easy peasy lemon squeezy. Oh, come on, I was so close. Come on, Gravelers! Come here! Mwah, mwah. I need them to sync up. Oh my god. Can you three take it easy? How long is it gonna give me? 10 seconds? Oh, boo. Freaking Mudkip, let me down. Oh, come on. Well, this is annoying. Okay, I got one. That's progress. Okay, come here, little Graveler. Nothing to be scared of. There we go. Perfect. Okay, yes, Graveler. Yeah, yeah, like always, your teamwork is too good, but don't think that's the only way to look cool. There are other ways of looking cool in this world. I know I said it, but that was a lame comeback. Bro, you should work on that before you try to come for me. Uh, alright, let's go. Oh my god, these people are so annoying. We must get to Fall City, our destination, which we reach by going through the Kraka Tunnel. I see, however, that there are two paths here. Which way is it? Ugh. Leave it up to me, sir. I've planted mushrooms on the correct paths as signs. Um, which was it now? <laughs> there, my mushroom. Commander, it's this way. God, these guys, I hate them. <laughs> You two? You're Pokemon Rangers? You're the muggers that- oh, sorry. You're the muggers that took the professor's egg. <laughs> give, up, give it up without a fight. Yeah, give it up. <sighs> Allow me to explain something, you two. This Manaphy egg is meaningful only if we possess it. Why, even Prof Hastings himself was told this by none other than his assistant in his very own lab. This is what she said. It would be funny if the Pokemon mistook you to be its mother. No truer words were spoken. That is why we decided to step in and take custody of the Manaphy egg. Do you understand now? And now we must bid you farewell. Okay, bye. Get out of here, crop top. Halt, Gorok Squad. Why does that guy seem to know exactly what's being said in the professor's lab? 
Hey, you sleepy peacenik rangers. You're not getting past me. Just to make up for it, I'll tell you about our deliciously evil plan. Oh my god, the monologuing. Sis, my voice, like my throat hurts. Can we take it easy? We're going to hatch Manaphy and, from the egg and get it to guide us to the sea temple. Manaphy is going to lead us to that sea crown thing. That way, our new boss is going to become the king of the seas. Oh my god, Aquaman? <laughs> He's going to be way bigger than our old boss, Gordor. Like, no comparison. That's enough talking. I'm switching to attacking. Oh no, not the Rattatas. My worst fear. Come here, Rattatas. Uh, thank you very much. Ugh. Just gotta freaking capture this guy's eggs. It's such a weird game. That's such a weird thing to say. Sir, can I have your egg? Your capturing skills are solid, but you can't go as far as forcibly taking the Pokemon egg from us, can you? Uh, if you need me to want to square up, we'll square up is all I'm saying. That's what hobbles you. That's a funny looking mushroom. Uh, the pet's was in it too. Which way is it? Um, which was it now? Sir, there's literally one way to go. There, my mushroom! Commander is this way! Oh god. Ugh. Oh, freaking zoo bats. Freaking bats. It's the Gorog Squad's Pokemon! Can't you guys just, like, give it up? You're irrelevant! You don't matter! The Gorog Squad is nothing anymore! Okay, let's go. Darn it. You'd better remember this. Oh my god, what is it with these people and wanting me to remember them? Sis, you're a little irrelevant. Ooh. Look at this fun little tree. Swallow! It's a wild swallow. Ah, she's quick. But not quick enough for me. Thank you. Hi, little guys. The Go Rock Squad will once again grace the history books. Once again? Sis, you're nothing. They're the Go Rock Squad's Pokemon. Freaking me out. I literally captured Rayquaza, Kyogre, Groudon, Entei, Raikou, uh, Suicune, Celebi, like all those guys, and you're still gonna try to come for me? Like, excuse me? The Gorok Squad's future looks bleak. Your butt looks- your mom is bleak. The pest was in it too. Which way is it? Oh, uh, which was it now? There, my mushroom. <laughs> Commander, it's this way. That's absurd, that's not your mushroom. That's not your mushroom, dog. That's a parasect. Oh, not the scyther. Come here. Come here, crop top. We're tenacious, but you're even more tenacious. It's just a little baby scyther. Come here. Come here, little baby. Come here. Thank you. Gotcha. Just a little swooperini. Nothing to see here. A little loop-de-loop. -loop, and we're good. Bye-bye. <sighs> Bleh to you. You're not getting back the Manaphy egg. You're, you're a Manaphy egg. Oh my god, step off. The pla- the- the pass- uh, the pass pass is too. Which way is it? Oh, which was it now? <laughs> God. These guys are dumb. There, my mushroom. <laughs> Commander, it's this way. Oh. I just... What are these guys even? Well... They're probably gonna loop back around, so let me, uh... Can I use Swallow on- Swallow, ma'am. Yes, get Swallow's help. 
the big mushroom was actually a wild parasite. Okie dokie. Cute. Alright, let me chase these suckers. Oh, these guys are so dumb. <laughs> They're a bunch of freaking idiots. <laughs> God. Ugh. These bunch of morons. Oh my god. No one gets in the way of the Gar Squad's resurrection. They're Gar Squad's Pokemon. Come here, Zubats. Oh, freaking Politoed. I understand you're nervous, Zubat, but you can't leave because you're being annoying. Oh, come on. Holly Toad, stop jumping. You're being uh, ridiculous right now. Capture complete. Okay, bye. Darn it, you better remember. Oh my god, enough. Enough. Oh, Pikachu, can you please get out of my way? As well, Pikachu. Yeah, she's absolutely wild. Bye, see you never. Oh my god, the Rattatas. Oh my god. Just let it end. Let my suffering end. Woohoo! Capture complete. The Gorg Sports feature looks bleak. Yeah, run. You better run for your life, sucker. Just when are we going to reach Fall City? S sir, I'm sorry, sir. We shouldn't be far now, I think. Uh... This path splits into two again. Which way? Um, which was it now? There, my mushroom. <laughs> there, my mushroom is such a good line. Commander, it's this way. Is it though? Is it that way? Come here, I'm gonna get ya. I'm gonna get you, I'm gonna get you, I'm gonna get you. <laughs> you led us into a cul-de-sac. How utterly pathetic, incapable of even the simple task of guiding me through the forest. Um, but I, there were mushrooms as trail markers. What the? They chased me down? What were my stooges doing? To be outwitted by mere children? Yeah, I'm like nine. My underlings are failures. Every last one of them. Yeah, complete failures. Uh, looks like you've cornered yourself. There's no getting away this time. Why don't you realize that it's hopeless and turn over the egg quietly? Snicker. Don't let my looks fool you. I'm going to be the new Gorok Squad boss. No, not only that, I am the chosen one. I shall come to reign as the absolute ruler of all Fiori. Don't you understand? Your mere act of speaking against me is an act of vile insolence. Before you utter another word from your impudent mouth, I will give you a lesson you won't forget. Oh my goodness. This is a little dramatic, but okay. What the heck was that? Vita's are. This is so rude! Stop doing vines. Vine is dead. Where Haven't you heard the news? It's really sad, actually. This is kind of ridiculous. I should have gotten a Pokemon. Um, can you? I don't even know if Puzzle's gonna do anything. Because it doesn't work against the grass types. Okay, got a Scyther. Scyther, stop moving around. Oh my god, Venusaur. Oh, god. Venusaur! Oh, come on, I was so close. That's ridiculous. Come here, Scyther! Oh, come on. Right there. 
Spider, come here. Spider, enough! Okay, finally. Okay, I've whittled it down to one. No, I don't think. I wasn't. I'm not about to trust that. Thank God Venus are slow as shit. Okay, thank God. Venusaur spits out large seeds. They sprout giant vines that get in the way. Obviously. Clearly. No shit, Sherlock. I... Impossible. It's inconceivable that I lost. Call me a sore loser, but you're never getting this egg away from me. I'll beat you up. Oh, I didn't even do the voice. Guess it doesn't matter. Wasn't that good anyway. Uh, call me a coward, but I will flee. What the heck? No, we got away! Where are you going, though? I really gotta chase this guy all over the place? This is ridiculous. Oh my god, Gordor! Yeah, yeah, Gordor! It's- oh, the voice. It's been a while, Malvira. The Manaphy egg isn't just something that anyone can hold thoughtlessly. It isn't something that is simply beautiful. It contains a life. At the very least, the one who should be looking after this egg isn't this fool. Ow, 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 ow. Oh, please, stop twisting my arm like that, Gordor. You abandoned the Gorak squad? What made you come back like you own the place? Ow, ow, ow. Okay, okay, I got it. You can have your egg. Snatched it right up. This is the Manaphy egg. Gordor, what did you do after disbanding the Gorak squad? It's been like a day. I've done nothing in particular since then. I've thought a lot. I thought about how you saved me at the very end. I felt small and ashamed of my own petty pride that was next nothing next to the glare of your nobility. It was pathetic, but it was all I could do to flee in shame. But I've awakened from the nightmare. I've finally realized that what I should be doing is making amends for my crimes. I ask myself every day what I can do to make things better for people. I don't think that I can ever atone for all my misdeeds, but I must try. You are the ones who awakened me to become what I am today, and for that, I owe you a thanks. Well, you haven't lost your habit of talking forever. Uh, thank you. And please, for give my regards to Prof Hastings. God, shut up. Wow, he was like a changed man. Really interesting how he just appeared out of nowhere. It was as if he hatched from an egg or something. This egg, we better get take it back safely. Ah, both of you, you're back. And then look at you, cradling that Manaphy egg as if it were a newborn child. Quick, quick, let me have a close look. Ew, a child. Professor, please try to stay calm while I say this. This egg, we recovered it in the end with Gordor's help. He appears to have changed after Malvira saved him that time. What did you say? Did you say Gordor? He recovered the Manaphy egg. Good work, both of you. If the remaining Gorok squad holdouts were to get this, there's no telling what sort of trouble would brew up. Oh, my headphones just fell off my head. Ah! All is right in the world again. If Gordor really had a change of heart for the better, then we can credit that to you, too. Yeah, I know. That's mission cleared, you two. And I got my man up the egg. Love it. We love to see it. Oh, that's right, everyone. Listen, Murph did a fantastic job on his mission. I think he should tell us in his own words. Well, the mission I was assigned was to help the assistant lady search for reference material, so I was helping, and then I saw this huge book, so I started flipping through it, and that's when I found it. The book was hollowed out, and there was a listening device in it. You bet I was surprised. I mean, it was this transistor radio bug. I was li it was listening in. The assistant lady joked, did the professor set it to see if I was saying things behind his back? But on close inspection, we found a Gorg Squad logo on it. Why would they put their logo on that? That is ridiculous. They were eavesdropping on the professor. Murph, wow, that is so cool. <laughs> oh, poor Murph. Imagine finding a bugging device. That's like something straight out of a spy movie. By the way, professor, are you a maybe not getting along too well with your assistant? What a thing to say. I resent that insinuation. Me, consider my assistant a spy. That only happened once. Uh, no, no, no. Never once have I thought of her as a spy. But regardless, I will buy my assistant a gift and get her back on my good side. Or get her, get back on her good side. 
Stop talking about people's good sides. Do you maybe mean that egg is going to be a gift to her? Oh, no, no. This is no gift. This is an invaluable research specimen. Sir, this is a baby. This egg still remains largely shrouded in mystery. It's going to be the prince of the sea. How is the Gorok Squad planning to make this egg hatch in the first place? There have been no reports of successful egg Pokemon egg hatching in the Fury region as far as I know. Then how are there Pokemon if they can't hatch from their eggs? You're serious? As serious as a broken Styler, yes. What's more, this happens to be an ultra rare Manaphy egg. How are we supposed to, to approach this delicate issue of hatching the egg? Professor, even you don't know. I just thought of something good. Why don't we catch the Gorok Squad and get them to look after the egg until it hatches? Oh, Murph. Oh, wait a minute. That would put us back to where we all started, wouldn't it? Actually, knowing them, they probably already ran off somewhere far away. Hmm, Murph, what did you just say? Somewhere far away? Brilliant. There is that option. For example, in the Sinnoh region, there should be many highly skilled Pokemon trainers. Rather than keeping the Manaphy egg here, we should have someone in the Sinnoh region hold it for us. For the time being, I will take the egg back to the lab. Murph, thank you for a most useful idea. Huh? Did I say something good? Why are you surprised? Poor Murph. Special mission cleared. What will become of the egg to be continued on the ranger net? Okay, bye. Gonna save the game? And there she is. Okay, well, that was great. Data has been saved. We got the egg. Okay, so I think you can transfer it if you have a cartridge for Pokemon Diamond and or Pearl. Don't know how that works, but not my problem. So in the next one, we'll do the last special mission. Oh my gosh, crazy. So thank you for watching and I will see you in the next one.